I have rejected so many players since I have been playing this account. It's been over two years now that I've said no to many players. They've invited me before to create a jumping project account in which I have said, hey, I really can't do it because I don't really have the time to do it. But for some reason now, I've changed my mind. My name is Shinchi42. In today's video, I am going to announce to you something amazing and something new that is potentially going to happen in my current progress here in Rise of Kingdoms. If you are new and you have not subscribed to the channel, consider subscribing and turn your notification on. Also, before we get started, please head to the new channel. We have a brand new channel and the first 100 people to subscribe to the channel and comment to the videos will have a chance to win $100. Are you guys ready for a jumping project again from Shinchi42? It's been freaking two years since I have started a brand new account and this is the account that I had. So if you guys can actually see, we have how many days now? 990 days, absolutely insane. When this account was created, it was where? Who knows it? It was in 1253. Now we are in 1412. We've gone a long way, we've gone a long journey already. We've migrated a few times already. Now, a lot of players have asked me this. They said, can you create a free to play account? So with that being said, with our new jumping project, if this is um, officially, uh, basically officially agreed on that we're gonna do this, I know they had a little bit of an issue for that player who asked me to join them into the jumping project, I honor my word when I said, yes, I will go with you, which I cannot disclose yet because there's no concrete, like full plan yet. But I think they have a group that are going to be the, doing the jumping project. I know I saw some um, messages saying that uh, they kind of doubt the person about me joining them to do a jumping project. So officially, I'm announcing it today that once everything is finalized, Shinchi is going to create a brand new account, a new account for the jumping project, and I'm going to be a free to play player in that account. One other thing also I did not disclose a long time ago, I did create a free to play account in a different kingdom. Actually, it's in this, in this account, all right, in this Gmail. And it was just really hard for me to play it because I have to, you know, switch back and forth with the main. So what I'm going to do is, of course, I'm going to be running it on BlueStacks. I'm going to run a multi-instance. I'm going to create a new email. And with that, I will then create that new account. Now with that new account, what is going to be my plan? Am I going to be an archer gang, an infantry gang, a, you know, cavalry gang, or a siege gang? Okay, definitely not siege gang. Who's a siege gang in here? But okay, what we're gonna do in that new account, I am probably not going to play as an archer player, right? Because I've already have this account that plays with archers and I've got everything that I want in here. And I also have majority of the infantry commanders in this account as well. So what does that leave me to? Now, if I'm going for calves, you know, we've talked about some of the calves commander, like commander that is like Saladin, is a great commander for free to play. And this is going to give me an opportunity to play with a commander like this. Now, the biggest challenge that I'm going to have really is holding off myself from spending into the game if I am going to be a free to play player. Now, I wanna ask you in the comment section below, how, how long can Shinchi42 last being a free to play player, all right? So I'm gonna start a new, new account, and this account, um, basically what I'm gonna say is that I don't think I can also play it like completely. So we're gonna have a little deal 
so that I can actually start the account. All right. So running an account, you know, multiple accounts, I've been playing this game and other games is going to be very challenging for my time. So I may need a little bit of an assistance for that. So we're going to create that account. We're going to start the jumping project. And I'm really just curious on how it's going to really turn out. I mean, I have to start from, you know, from fresh in here, right? We're going to have to start from fresh and getting all these, you know, epic commanders again and starting out from there. So a thing that I'm probably going to do is going to go for the civilization of, I think I've talked about this before. If I'm going to start out again, I am going to go for the China civilization because we want to get Zun 2, which is a really, really good epic commander. Now, this is an archer, right? All right. This is an archer but is an epic commander that is infantry. But then at level 10, you're going to get a Civ change. Now, when I do my Civ change, I am most likely going to go for Germany. So that is kind of like my, my ideal plans right now. So I'm not so sure yet and how everything is going to be laid out, but it's just, it's, you know, I've rejected so many players. I'm so sorry if I rejected you guys. I know you guys have asked me a lot because at some point of my gaming, I wish I've accepted some of the jumping project because I know a lot of the YouTubers have done a uh, multiple jumping project, but they don't really do a free-to-play one, I think. I don't think they were able to, to do free-to-play. But I'm going to do is a free-to-play, and let's see if I can challenge myself doing a free-to-play account. It's going to be very challenging, especially with resources, with speed ups, and especially getting the commanders and, of course, the gears. Now, I'm just going to hope in that jumping project is that we're going to have huge whales that I can pretty much survive. Now, being a YouTuber, I probably will have an edge because then I'll be accepted, right, in the alliance, regardless if I'm a little bit weaker just because of the status. And I hate to have that status, but it's something that is. You know, I mean, they have to accept me because if not, there's no point of me doing a jumping project. There's no point of the invitation. Now, I want to lay it out here because that's something that majority of people will not have a perks with. So I do understand that there is some privileges comes with the status as well. So but I just want you guys to understand that it might be slightly still a little different if I am playing the free to play account compared to majority of the people who is going to play the free to play account. So we will see because... The goal is, I think, sometime next month to initiate the jumping project. So I'm not so sure if the plan is still now 100% because I heard there's some issues, um, you know, teams not working together. But I think the player who has invited me is still determined to start a jumping project. So I've, you know, I'm the type of guy, if I say my word, you know, my word is my bond. And um, I said to him, you know what? Yes but I have that condition. But if he is able to accommodate for my condition, then we can definitely start a brand new account that is going to be a free-to-play. I'm very excited. I don't know if you're excited or not because starting as a free-to-play is really, really challenging. Oh my goodness. I can't even think about how am I going to get those, uh, those blueprints, right? I'm going to get those jams. I need them. Right, so if I go here to the shop, how am I gonna get this? How did you guys do this? The master blueprint. Actually, it's only two thousand. Okay, never mind. Damn, I don't remember. I thought it was twenty five thousand a piece. It's so much cheaper than I thought. Or did they made it so much cheaper? Was it twenty five thousand back then? I thought it was more. I thought it was a lot more expensive. For some reason, it's only two thousand. Damn. I was wrong. Oh, man. I guess you just don't remember now. It's been so long since we've maxed out the buildings. I guess if it's all 25000 that's like so expensive to do it. Boy, I don't even remember. Um, I, okay. Well, that's uh, that's kind of like embarrassing because I forgot how much the master blueprint cost. <laughs> well, that just means it's time for me to start a reset project. It's time for me to, to restart in here and try... You know, seeing the new versions of Rise of Kingdoms for two years, because from when I started, you know, this is a time where YSG, Richard, they are still in the tavern. And it's just so different now, right? There's locks that, you know, for the commanders, there's gears that you can't use as well, if I'm correct. So with all these updates that Rise of Kingdoms have been pushing, it didn't really affect my main account because I'm in such an old kingdom. And the knowledge, 
I lost some knowledge there because I'm not doing any reset. I'm not doing any refresh into my knowledge. So it's time for me to refresh my knowledge into the starting project and kind of give this new approach to the viewers, to the new players that are coming in and how to approach more of the free to play approach. Now, if you guys don't know as well with this account, as you guys can see, we've been stuck with 15K gems. I really haven't been spending much into this account, right? Um, I have a lot of speed ups, so much speed ups. The only really thing what I'm doing is trying to get gold because that's one in my bottleneck. I've spent so much before that I haven't used a lot of the stuff as well. I am enjoying being a free to play here. We're in 1412. It's very chill. And um, actually, I need to start talking to them again because I've been so busy in life. I've been trying to do you know a bunch of different things to be successful, like starting that new channel that you have already subscribed, which is thank you so much. And you know, it's just stuff in life that I'm just trying to catch up on and trying to enjoy. And I want to be able to travel, especially now with COVID restrictions, a little bit easier. Where should I travel? Should I travel to your country? Would you be able to host me? <laughs> um, but anyway, so we're definitely going to start a new account. I'm really excited for that. By the way, they changed the talent reset in here. Ooh, very interesting. Um, nice book and has that graphics there, which is really cool. Is uh, leadership, is it skill, and then um, conquering? Right, nice. So that bottleneck as well. Oh, yeah, man. I got to think about the Book of Covenant too. That's going to be the hardest grind because the Arrow of Resistance, you can definitely get it, especially if you try to do a jump in a KVK past glory one, then you can you can do the Arrow of Resistance. There's a few tricks that you can do. Oh, my God, I'm so excited to try it out. Um, the Book of Covenant, yeah, this is going to be challenging because I know it takes a lot of Book of Covenant to really get into that castle. Um, so if I'm excited, are you excited? Would you want to join us? Maybe I will ask the jump leader if you know they want to be recruiting people from YouTube. But it doesn't mean that I'm going to stop my account here in 1412. This is still going to be my main account and this is still going to be my priority. 1412 is still going to be the number one in my heart. But starting up a new project, I think it's going to be very interesting because I get to meet new people. The excitement of starting from the ground up and getting to the uh, temple, I think is going to be very exciting. I do miss, miss, I do miss those days where you still have to fight in the kingdom and try to achieve a peace. I think that's going to be really interesting when that time uh, comes and I'm just super duper excited. If there's anyone who is super duper interested into joining this, maybe you guys can message me. I don't know if I can connect you to the jump leader and then we can talk and discuss what is that going to be about. Or we can just be super quiet and not tell anybody that we're going to do a jumping project until it's done. All right. We'll see what happens, guys. There's a few things that we have to do. And it's very exciting. What's next? It's very interesting. Don't forget to subscribe, turn your notification on, and I'll see you again next time.